<laughs> do you want to do this till the day you die? Do you yeah. want to act as long as possible? Yeah, I'd like to say, oh, I, I saw John Glover on stage when he died. <laughs> I'll die on stage. Really? Yeah. That's how, you want to work to the last minute. Yeah. Why? Why? Because that's what I do. That's what gets me off. Well, <laughs> there are other things. Yeah, but that's the best thing. When I'm doing somebody, I'm being somebody else. It's freeing. Really? That's that's how you your excitement is being someone else is is. Yeah. You, how you thrive yeah pretending to be someone else yep. is it is it do you, do you love yourself i know that's a really weird question but do, i mean do you like yourself can you look in the mirror and go you know john i think you're a good guy i love you sometimes i like myself so sometimes i don't what don't I, you like about yourself uh, uh less i see i grew up less than because i was different than the other little boys i you know my dad, my dad was so athletic, and he taught me how to hit a ball and throw a ball and do a football and throw a football. <laughs> right. and, I, and he taught me well, but I wasn't interested in it. Mm -mm. So, so I, you know, I, I was made fun of a lot when I was in school because I, you know, because you felt you were different. People thought you were different. Yeah, less than, and that and that gave me this feeling of being less than. So, but I found. I remember in high school, I, I we were doing the importance of being earnest. I think that was the play with June Allen Kitzmiller. Right. Yeah. June Allen Kitzmiller. June Allen Kitzmiller. She was a good, good actor too, but um, and she could sing. I sing off key, so I can't do musicals, <laughs> but I love musicals. I do too. Yeah. Uh, yeah, but it. it uh, but you did that. But, you, but you, I remember you, we had a, a, a like a. In the cafeteria, there was a uh, where where we did the play. The whole school came. You did a play in a cafeteria. Yeah. Well, they, we didn't have a stage, so in the they cafeteria the room, out. they put yeah, they took the right. tables out and set a platform up, and they did it there. And there was a, a an assembly where we sort of did a preview of it. And so I was sort of you know with English accents and everything, and I was doing the thing, and people started laughing at me. And it felt, I, I, I had control of, of, of all these people that, that I went to school with, a lot of which di who didn't like me or anything, but I could make them laugh. Do you know, I, had, <clears throat> I talked about it, but I, I had the same thing. When I was a little boy, I was the smallest kid. I was not popular, all this stuff. You guys, listeners, have heard this. But I finally did a play, and it was the first time Anybody paid any attention to me. We're the same. We're the same any people. Any attention. <laughs> yeah. A popular kid walked down and said, the hallway the next day and said, you were really funny in that play. <laughs> yeah. And I, from that moment on, from a 16-year-old boy, 17-year-old boy, I said, not being me is what I'm going to be. We're the same. 